Oh, it is. Let's go, dude. Fucking straight into it. Does it give me anxiety already, I love dude? this shit, dude. No, no. See, I wouldn't even thought to hold the fucking shoelaces. <laughs> I just threw the boot. <laughs> oh, if anyone can do it, he can fucking yeah, do dude, it. Yeah, dude. This me. I love this shit. This is great. He's a fucking Wahlberg, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see Mark Wahlberg's um, regimen? Yeah. Oh, shit. You know the deal, oh, Mr. God. Wahlberg. I don't want this. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, he'll do it, too. He He's will. a Wahlberg, bro. He don't give a fuck. Oh, he's breaking. Oh, no. Oh, he, oh, he's breaking his foot. Oh, my God. Why? So we can just pull it out? Yeah. Wouldn't you just cut it off at that point? No, because you'd bleed out. That way, he's not going to bleed. Oh. <gasps> Look at that. Oh, like it's nothing. Bro, there's like, there's like, there's like, the majority of all your bones are in your foot. There's like, there's like, oh, I think almost a hundred bones in, in your foot. Oh my god, why is it in his mouth? Oh shit. Oh my god. Oh, this poor guy. Oh, it's in his traps. Oh my god. Oh. He's not gonna be able to get the jaw out. Oh that. He my has to go through bone. god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. That shit will be tender too, bro. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh my god. What the fuck? Shoot first, ask questions later. I don't know about that. What if it's what like I'm her kid about. playing a prank? <laughs> <laughs> Turn Billy into Mom. a fucking shish kebab. <gasps> oh, oh my god. No! Oh, she's See, done. now that... See, like... They're just going off the rails now. Like his his whole thing is slowly like turned into like his whole idea of uh, of making people who did something wrong yeah. like pay. Like it's it's just not there anymore. I said that in the beginning. That's what I know. This the reputation for the franchise. Like it just progressively gets more just about this stuff. Dude, you can pour that. I, I you probably can, but I don't know why she's not. What the fuck? Dude, you can just pour it out, can't you? That's what it. Yeah, it's on fucking chains. Look at all the slack in it. I know. You just lift it up and... That's what I'm saying. Or at least some of it. Yeah. Oh, she did it. Oh, she my God. It. Oh, my God. Oh, my she got hurt. it. Oh. What the fuck? Oh, Jesus. my God. Oh, and zero to 100? Holy shit. Who the Who fuck are it? these people? Who are they? I want a divorce. What's wrong? <laughs> Be getting, a man. <laughs> man's getting played. A divorce. Oh, dude, shit. I called you. Did call it? Oh my god. <laughs> you could tell, dude, the uncomfortableness. Yeah, the situation. I've been there. <laughs> We've been there before. A divorce. No air entry on the right side. And? <laughs> and? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is he saying? Lynn Denlon should have been the first one there. Get your shit together, girl. And she's popping Zannies. Come Dude, on, and girl. And she's got a kid, apparently. Lynn, put this. Put Unless her boyfriend drew that. <laughs> 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 she's got to have he a did, kid. He drew that. She stabbed the kid, and boom, she's done, I'm dude. I've been clocking out. That's all. You, that's all you have to do to be a doctor. <laughs> dude, I could be a doctor. I just look at a YouTube video. I could be a doctor. What the fuck? This dude got a sweatshop now. It's their evil lair. <laughs> my boy. <laughs> Dude's a vegetable. Oh my god. <laughs> my man. Was good. <laughs> <laughs> Where am I? <sighs> Hold on, bitch! I'm drinking water. <laughs> Just fucking Death is die a surprise already. Party. Surprise party. <laughs> With You're balloons dead. and confetti. <laughs> is, is she supposed to fix him? He's fucking dying. The device that you're wearing is linked to my heart rate monitor. What? The second that heart rate. Motherfucker, monitor you're gonna mine. die. What are you, you talking about? about? Range? An explosion will go off in that collar. What? Your life and my life. The Two got firecrackers on. Oh no, there's a shotgun <laughs> there. You will keep him alive, whatever it takes. He's dying. <laughs> no excuses. <laughs> Look at him. He's <laughs> done. You don't touch things in mm. Dylan's room. Oh, Dylan. <gasps> Dylan. Who's Dylan? Dylan. Okay. 
It's nobody. It's <laughs> Dylan. Dylan. Your self-centered ass to him. Oh, this girl's so annoying. No one's going to any hospital. Okay, so then he's dead. Like <laughs> she's so annoying. Or else he's gonna die. So are you. Ugh, look at look at her. Look how you disgusting she looks. Look at this <laughs> ugly. Oh my <laughs> god. Were you were just complimenting her teeth. He dies? No, it's complimenting her teeth. <laughs> I'm talking about Amanda. I was like, asking me to do oh, the oh my god. The wig and lipstick on me. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking disgusting. Amanda. Amanda. <laughs> <laughs> Enough. <laughs> <laughs> Even he's fed up with listening to her stupid ass. Oh my god. <laughs> he's, doing, he's doing the floss. <laughs> oh my god. What are you doing? Even with an anesthetic, anesthetic widows. I need you to shut the fuck up. Am I supposed to care? I don't know. About this. Ugh. I don't know. I just want to spit on her. <laughs> She's so annoying. She probably like it. Oh, Meanwhile, we got Jeffy, boy. We got like four different plot lines going on right now. Imagine if he didn't wait like fucking three minutes. How did he even see that behind all those pipes? I probably wouldn't have seen it. It's a little late, Jeff. It's a little late. <laughs> <laughs> You'll be missed. <laughs> fucking idiot. I go for the neck, but I'm not the brain surgeon. Just oh. do it quietly, she, she was breaking like down the last scene, and yeah. now she's the cockiest, like, person in the world. He made it through the freezer room. <laughs> what? Do you think he wants to hear that now? <laughs> why is <laughs> why she, she, co why she crying? Because she loves him. You're in my desk, the center drawer, an envelope, your name on. <laughs> There's some cash in there for you. <laughs> some fucking scratch tickets. <laughs> I can't do this. <laughs> it's so hard on her. This dude's dying. He's dying to see your fucking scratch those tickets. He's dying. <laughs> it's one of those ones where it says you won, but it's a joke. <laughs> fucking Jeff, dude. I keep forgetting Jeff's in this. <laughs> like I said, there's like five plot lines going on. Where is Donnie? I know. I was thinking that it's too. it's gonna be some like crazy twist at the end with Donnie. There's a reason they're not showing him. And there's a reason they showed him in the beginning, yeah. cracking his fucking leg yeah. or foot. He's somewhere, and you don't know where. <gasps> Just drop Close it your on. mouth. Close your mouth. Oh no! Oh, you don't remember me? Oh my god, dude, this is the shit. Yeah, I don't like him anymore. <laughs> Watch, he's gonna. I'm gonna die. See, I know it's trying to establish us like caring about him and his relationship with his son. It's just not doing a good job. He's just a piece of shit, though. Like killing all these people isn't gonna yeah, bring like, him back or make like, him any better. I mean, I wouldn't understand. <laughs> Please help me. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I understand. I wouldn't understand losing the son, and I'm sure it makes you like want everybody else to die. Yeah. But it's still at the same time, it's like it's not doing a good job of making me care about his relationship with his son because it was never established. Well, yeah, I mean, yeah. Even though it's always like you're being too negative. I'm not being negative. I'm trying listen, to see his side. Listen, this movie. No, we have to say this movie's perfect. All right. Uh, Otherwise, you're negative. It's gonna be too late. Yeah, for sure. You don't even hear the guy anymore. He's gonna come back to the guy. You just see the tip of his nose sticking out. <laughs> <laughs> I called it. Oh, that's so fucking gross, dude. Dude, he's gonna like. He might just die alone with all this shit getting in him. I know. It's like, oh, maggots rot. Oh. oh my god. Yeah, dude, he's probably gonna. Oh. I almost gagged. It help you with your headaches and drastically improve your motor skills. You understand? <laughs> You're gonna be running like a champ after this. <laughs> You're, gonna <laughs> You're gonna skip on out of here after what I'm doing to you. <laughs> I'm done drilling into your skull, dude. <laughs> With a literal drill. Oh my god. Oh, okay. I don't know if a dog would do that. <sighs> I don't know if those hands. <laughs> yeah, those are doctor's hands. You definitely cheated your way to become a yeah, doctor. That's like Doctor Strange's hands after the accident. He had an accident? Yeah, that's how he. That's why he becomes Doctor Strange, bro. Oh yeah. Fuck, just cutting that bitch open with scissors. Ah. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> safety scissors. <laughs> yeah, it's the ones with the patterns in them. Handle this, man. It's really bugging me. Oh shit. That's his little flame. Dude, he's like 80. Johnny boy. <laughs> Johnny boy. He's just fucking pushing him around in a wheelchair. Oh 
she's gonna be mad. Is she jealous? Oh, she's of gonna that? kill him. She's gonna kill him. I bet you she's gonna kill him. No, I think she's gonna kill the doctor. What are you doing? Oh, she's cutting herself. Why? What are you doing? This bitch is crazy. Oh, oh, she, cause she probably used to do that. Put it away. He don't even love you no more. How do you feel? He's got a new side piece. People in the comments, I'm giving her the benefit of the doubt. This little connection they got going on. I understand it, but she's a fucking nutcase. <laughs> you crazy bitch. <laughs> <laughs> you know I like this shit, right? <laughs> Looks on you. Dude's hard as a rock right now. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? I don't know. Someone just snap, crackle, and bop. I got my man strapped up. What's Who is this oh. now? How many people were involved with the kid's murder? <laughs> what the fuck? I don't think this. Oh, oh, oh no. I don't yeah. think this judge is understanding, though, your accomplice to murder. Yeah, he has to pull the fucking gun. What is this he? dude's a. F I fucking hate this guy. He's fucking just tapping it on shit. <laughs> Can we put Jeff in the rack? <laughs> What's he trying to pull him? It's back? okay, my child. It's okay. Petition to put Jeff in the rack. You fucking trap. Be gone. Be gone. She's done. Oh, she gonna start <laughs> shadow boxing. <laughs> she start shadow boxing. <laughs> She was literally standing still. Stop moving. <laughs> 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 Fucking jazz hands making her uncomfortable. Oh, there he is. Oh, yes. <gasps> My man. Come on. Mr. Wahlberg. Come on, Mr. Wahlberg. Come on, Mr. Wahlberg. Oh, yo, yo, yo. Do not let her fucking kill you, bro. Yes. Yes, yes dude. Yes. Come on. She'd Come on. Be knocked out right there. Come on, not Donnie. Even, not even a chance. Come on, Donnie. Put in a rear naked choke. His name's Mr. Wahlberg. She would be, she would be done. Is she done? No. If she gets back. No, because we know she's not, because she's with them. That's not what I mean. I just mean knocked out. Nice. You just murdered Jeff's wife. That is it. Wait, what? Oh. Wait, that's his what? What? I guess. This guy loves taking his so weed ass. I know. Ass. I, thought, I was just gonna say that. Yeah, hold a hand a little bit. Why don't you kiss her too, you fucking idiot. I didn't think he was actually gonna do it. D this dude must not care. One, he hasn't learned dick. His wife. And he doesn't care wife, about his wife. His wife is fucking dying. Well, he just killed her. He's so fucking stupid. He really is. <clears throat> I'll start by saying I think Jeff is the worst character out of all three movies so far. Yeah. It started off, I think, very poorly, but then got better towards the end. I think the the second one and this one start off that way, but they end better because I think just the twist sort of exposes itself, like it shows itself, like, oh, this is the twist at the end. So that's why you're like, oh, it's it's getting a little better. Um, but it was definitely trying to make us care about characters again that we didn't necessarily care about, like they didn't do a good job. Of it, like Amanda, they were showing us her, what she was dealing with because she had to kill all those people and, and she was like dealing with being that person and doing that to everybody. But we didn't really care. You know, they were trying to show Jeff being a father and him losing his son and his sort of like his story. But we didn't, again, we didn't care. I don't know if it was necessarily about trying to make us care about him as much as I think it was just trying to get the themes across as like for like i don't really think we were meant to really care about mm. jeff i think it was just trying to get the point across of like forgiveness but even even with amanda like it, it was it all came together on her and her big test and she failed yeah she failed but i'm trying to make it so like the story was at first it wasn't really anything and then it turned into something interesting because they were all connected in some way which was cool but it still didn't make me care about any of the characters it just had me interested in, like, what's going to happen, you know? Less of, like, these characters being part of the story and more just, like, oh, this happened and this happened. Oh, that's a cool twist. Oh, this happened. Okay, now what's going to happen? Like, I think it did its job in keeping me 
interested in how it, how how are these people connected like what's gonna happen like the only part i cared about because it's a saw movie is the twists right yeah. so i was looking for those but it was trying to again like all movies do try to create these characters and these stories that should care about right but it didn't do a good job at that part it just do, did a good job at being a saw movie yeah you like, know what well, I mean? like i said i don't really we're not gonna know if because we're not the people who made it, so we don't really know what the intention was. If we were were supposed to care about Jeff and Amanda, I'm going to say no. Mm -hmm. I think, like I said, I think because it's Saw movies, they're just disposable yeah. characters. I don't really think we're supposed to get attached to them. Mm -hmm. And especially as like a writer and a director, and like you're going and writing Jeff as a character, you really think the audience would care about that? Maybe they would. Maybe they're that delusional, but I don't know. But I think they were just disposable characters to get the fucking the point across. I think any director would want a majority of the characters to be like cared about so you would get invested in the story but remember it's a saw movie yeah yeah but i think the characters to be cared about you want to write them in a way that they're cared about so i'm giving them the benefit of the doubt in just saying they did want us to care about these people but it just didn't turn out that way is what i mean amanda towards the end i think the character started to make sense yes yeah, like was. what she's dealing with it started to make sense but I, again it didn't build her up for me to care about her so, like, these things were making sense to me, as in Amanda's character and um, the doctor a little bit, and, and what's his name? Fuck, what's his name? Jigsaw. Oh. Like, their connection, it was making sense to me. Like, it, it, Amanda and, and Jigsaw. Yeah. And the doctor, I did care about a little bit, but, like, their connection was making more sense toward the end, but I didn't, I didn't like it enough. Like, it didn't make me care too much. I wouldn't say I cared about the doctor. I think I just felt more, like, sympathy. I think she was just the best actor out of them all. Well, it's, yeah, and probably the most likable. Besides that, Donnie, I think that's but. why what I'm saying is I like I liked her the most and cared about her a little bit. Yeah. But every every other character wasn't too much for me. But the relationship between Jigsaw and Amanda was there. Like it was, it made sense. I mean, yeah, you yeah you, you know understood I mean? through the perspective of but her fucking the, crazy again, ass. Again, like it, it didn't really affect me till the end, till everything was sort of started to get like put together well, yeah you would need all the pieces to fit no together. exactly but i feel like it's the job of a of a movie to like establish that and make you care at the beginning but maybe that's just how saw movies go like i you, think i think nothing that's how pieces it is. together until the end yeah like a jigsaw but yeah i thought i thought i liked it because it was a saw movie and it ended up being a saw movie for me it wasn't nothing like revolutionary it connected back to everything i guess which i would like something a little new and different not to connect back you know what i mean yeah. But it was good. It, it was. It did it, it, it did its job. I think it did too much of that. That they, they showed. <laughs> there was just they were just replaying the yeah, whole yeah, like re second movie like or we, first movie. We I mean. knew all the back backstory stuff to the first movie, but they spent so long showing yeah. the first movie and then the end sequence. Like, is it assuming that you didn't watch the first and second one? I mean, maybe you it did I mean? do that just in case people didn't. But I understand why they're doing like the callback to it, but it was it was still a lot. Like they were replaying the whole yeah, it was other like a, movie. It was like ten minutes from the first movie of like yeah. the backstory of him getting fucking ready in his wardrobe and then her yeah. putting at him. In the second movie too. Yeah. Yeah, it was a little much. I just wish it was a little different, but at the end of the day it was a song movie and I enjoyed it for that. Yeah. You know what I mean? I kinda would have preferred it if it stayed the route it was going. I was actually hyped in the beginning to see um Donnie. And it picked up yeah. right then. I would have preferred that storyline. Yeah, that would have been cool. Because I, ca I cared about Donnie. Because one, because yeah. he's Donnie Wahlberg. Yeah. But like two, he wasn't that bad of a no, character. He was, like, he was a good character. And he's a, he was a good actor. So like, yeah. it's easy to get behind. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, for a Saw movie, you know, we're not going and expecting this to win any Oscars. Yeah, no, so, I mean, of course. It was good for what it was. Yeah. The shock value. I'd the give traps. It, I would definitely give it like a six out of ten. I give it a six out of ten. Yeah, I'd, yeah, I'd fuck with a six. I, did, I don't think that's bad. As much as I was like, really hating on Amanda, towards the end, like I said before, it was starting to make sense. But that doesn't mean I really liked her as a character. Yeah, no. I still like. She was dealing with a lot, but like you're like cocky, and then you're like breaking down, and then you're cocky. Again. Well, it's just because like, she was so broken. As yeah, a person. no, and it. So, so what I'm saying is the character made sense, but it really pissed me off. Yeah. Because even if you're so broken, I don't think you're going to go, even if your emotions are all over the place, I don't think you're going to go from like, like, oh, listen to me, to like breaking <laughs> down and then back to like, oh, you'll kill me with this ass. Go ahead, yeah, do yeah. it. Like, maybe your emotions would be all over the place, but I don't think it'd be that. I don't think you'd be like well, we don't the know, boss right? bitch and then you're like, Ugh. like, I don't think that's how that works. Well, I think the purpose of that is just she's all, she's yeah. all emotionally broken when it comes to him. Yeah, yeah. It may, yeah, I guess. 
So I guess it did make sense. But I just I didn't like it. I didn't like her. Yeah, she's just unlikable. But yeah. yet again, I don't think Fucking she was meant to be likable. They're the villains. Yeah, so that's what I'm thinking about too. Like at the end of the day, they're going the bad back guys. To, to the director wanting these people for you not to like. You know what I mean? Like they they don't want you to like these certain people. And I think maybe the fact that we don't like them is what they wanted, and they did their job. You know what I mean? That's what I said. Yeah, it works. All right, <laughs> never mind. Cut that out. Whatever. Then that's fuck what you. I said. What about the traps? Nah, I don't think they were great. I'm because I mean, the one the first one like when they froze the lady. Yeah, that, that was, was kind of silly. Um, the the one uh, where they were just cutting up pigs and throwing like the slosh at the dude. Yeah, that was just silly. And then the last one was brutal. Yeah, with the, the with rack. the yeah rack city. But it was nothing like crazy. Yeah, I actually it wasn't anything exciting. I wouldn't say it was like anything different or innovative or anything. I had it in my head that they were a lot better than the second one, but then you just said that. Yeah, they weren't that great, honestly. Though I think shock factor, the second one was actually pretty good, especially when the needle pit. Yeah, that the, one was the, crazy. The second one overall was a way better movie, mm-hmm. way better. Yeah, the traps weren't even that great. Yeah, they weren't actually. The, I liked the pig one because it was just silly. <laughs> He's yeah. just getting hit with like guts of pigs. Which... Thing, thing is, Jeff ruined all the traps because, like, yeah. I don't know, it took like the intensity out of it because he's dealing with his stupid ass. So then it goes back to like you're not supposed to like these certain characters, right? Yeah. With like they're made for you not to like them. But are we supposed to like Jeff? Are we supposed to fail for him that he's going through all this shit? That's what I'm you saying. What I'm saying? I don't... That's what I'm saying. They did didn't do a good job at that. Like I know your point. You want there's there's characters that the director doesn't want you to like. So it's doing their job there. But Jeff is like, Are you supposed to care about him? He lost his his um son at the beginning. You don't know what happened to his wife and he's just trying to like get out of this shitty situation. For some reason he ended up in, in Jigsaw's game. So are you supposed to fail for him? But he's doing all this stupid shit? Or maybe it's supposed to be dramatic you're supposed to fail for him? Because I didn't end up liking him. No, I know you didn't either. Yeah, no, was, didn't. That, and at the end, you definitely don't like him. I don't think anyone's supposed to like him at the end. No. But going through it, are you supposed to? Like is it, what I wonder, you know what I mean? Like I said, I think he's just a character to get the point, the message across, or the theme across as like the for whole forgiveness bullshit. I think he was just the okay. pawn. Yeah, and Amanda's bigger game, right? I, I so was Amanda's so. just forgiveness? What was hers? I forget what I hers forget was. I forget what hers was. Yeah. Fuck that bitch, dude. I hated her. <laughs> Whatever. God. All right, boys and girls, there you have it. The highly requested Saw 3. If you'd like to watch this movie along with us, head on over to the Patreon linked in the description below. Hit that like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. So-